All right, more local news on the way. Southern Nevadans remembering the thousands of lives lost. How a local teacher who died in the 911 attacks is still impacting students today. And then... Are we saving more than 60%? The Clarion Hotel is closed and everything must go. A look at some of the history you could buy. Get more, pay less at Walker Furniture. Buy any item $5.99 or more and save 100 bucks. Like this $5.99 sofa, now $4.99. With no interest till 2016. Get more, pay less at Walker. I told them they couldn't watch their shows because you and I'd be watching the game. No, Hotel DuPaul encourages guests to watch TV on their schedule. And we can DVR six shows at once and store up to a thousand. Guests are well treated at Hotel DuPaul. Why is he doing that? I have no idea. Get Contour from Cox. Packages start at just $49.99 a month when you bundle. Upgrade your package to record any six shows at once and store a thousand. Want to get the appliance, furniture, mattress, or TV or your dreams? It's easy with Collins Yes Money. Even when other stores say no to credit, we say yes. In fact, we've said yes to over 5 million people. Want to be next? Just go to cons.com to apply and get approved the same day. Because good credit or bad credit, we think Everyone deserves to experience that yes feeling for themselves. I'd like to talk to you about a free public service that's available to all Nevadans. With one simple phone call to Home Again, you can find out if you qualify for federal or state programs. Call Home Again if you need help buying a home, restoring your credit, or modifying your home loan. It's free. It's legitimate. It works. Make the call yourself to find out. A no-fee public service from the Office of the Nevada Attorney General. 1-855-457-4638. 8 News Now closed captioning is brought to you by Centennial Hills Hospital. Visit us at erjustgoteasier.com to schedule your ER appointment. Get more, pay less at Walker Furniture. Buy any item $5.99 or more and save $100. Bucks. Like this $5.99 sofa, now $4.99. With no interest till 2016. Get more, pay less at Walker. This portion of 8 News Now is brought to you by Papa John's. Now, Nevada's first choice for news. This is 8 News Now, special edition. The 13th anniversary of the attacks on America was marked in Southern Nevada as many took time out to remember 9-11. Nearly 3,000 people were killed on 9-11, including 72 police officers and 343 firefighters and paramedics. And even though the terrorist attack happened in New York, the impact was definitely felt across the nation and in Washington, D.C. and Las Vegas, Nevada. But Tranya Poonswan has more on how Southern Nevada remembers. <laughs> The morning started with the tolling of the bell as Las Vegas firefighters at station number five paid tribute to their brothers in New York City who lost their lives on 9-11. I think it's something that's always in the back of our minds. It was something that really brought home uh, what we do every day. The American flag flying at this annual ceremony was the one that flew over the World Trade Center. This steel beam also came from Manhattan, once part of the Twin Towers, and given as a gift to the Las Vegas firefighters 10 years ago. Should we even begin to think that we should forget? I don't think so. Metro Police also took time to pay their respects to those killed in the terrorist attack. Under Sheriff Jim Dixon says from Syria to Afghanistan, threats against Americans are still real and we can never let our guards down. We do it because the people who brought down those towers that day and changed the way America sees the world they're still out there. Williams William was in New York City on 9-11. He just moved to Las Vegas earlier this year, and he says he had to be here to remember what happened. It's always a part of my life, so on the 11th, I want to be around people who it still affects. On the Las Vegas trip, the New York New York Casino has been the spot where people all over the world have come to pay their respects to the victims of 9-11. But today, this spot looks quite a bit different from years past. Gone were the thousands of hats, t-shirts, and other memorabilia. A recent renovation leaves a simple memorial plaque underneath two American flags standing at half-staff. 
Flags were also lowered at Palo Verde High School during the annual ceremony to honor Barbara Edwards. She's the Las Vegas teacher killed when American Airlines Flight 77 crashed into the Pentagon. She sounds like a beautiful person. I only wish I had the honor of knowing her. 17-year-old senior Antonia Telfayano was just four when 9-11 happened, but she says the attack has shaped her life and her dream of one day joining the military. That day was a nightmare for us, and that's all we can do is just we will never forget. Petrania Poonswan, 8 News Now. 9-11 memorials happened across the country with larger ones in Washington, D.C., and, of course, in New York. Michael Patrick Tucker. Lance Richard Cimolti. Family members read the names of the nearly 3,000 victims every year. It's a tradition. President Obama paid tribute through a ceremony at the Pentagon Memorial. There was also a service in Pennsylvania for the victims of Flight 93. And don't forget the tribute light from the site of the World Trade Center. It will shine all tonight through the dawn. Tonight, Metro officers are...